So this is a polished concrete floor. Pretty nice, huh? Before work began, the floor looked like this. Not as nice, is it? To really understand how we got this, out of this, we have to dive into the chemistry of concrete floors. Here are the basic building blocks of concrete. Small aggregate, large aggregate, and cement paste. This is what holds everything together and makes concrete hard. But in with that hard cement is calcium hydroxide. It is left over from the hydration process and it isn't hard like the rest of the slab. In fact, it is actually pretty soft. If this stuff is left in your floor, it reacts with carbon dioxide in the air, turns into a chalky dust and you end up with a thin layer of dust on everything in the building. Densification is the process of applying a liquid silicate hardener to the concrete to get rid of that calcium hydroxide. That makes the floor stronger against wear and tear, so it will look better and last longer. Now, a concrete slab is usually 4 to 6 inches thick, but all the wear and tear happens in the top 16th inch wear zone of the concrete. That's where the concrete is most vulnerable, so most hardeners target all their power there. And different chemical hardeners do this in different ways. The most common are sodium silicate and potassium silicates. These chemicals react with that soft calcium hydroxide and turn it into calcium silicate hydrate, which is a much harder molecule. The application of a sodium or potassium silicate most often involves repeatedly scrubbing them into the floor and flushing with water. This generates hazardous wastewater that needs to be disposed of properly. A colloidal silica works differently. It fills small pores in the concrete with silica. This makes the concrete stronger. But there is little chemical reaction that takes place, so most of the soft calcium hydroxide remains in the floor. Compared to other chemicals, lithium silicate technology is a relative newcomer to concrete floors. Like sodium or potassium silicates, lithium silicates are reactive, so they turn the soft calcium hydroxide into hard calcium silicate hydrate, but they don't have to be scrubbed and flushed, so they are easier to apply and don't generate any hazardous wastewater. Lithium silicates are often more expensive per gallon, but lithium silicates are more reactive, so they make the concrete harder and have higher coverage rates than other hardeners, so you end up buying fewer gallons for the floor. For these reasons, lithium silicates are quickly growing in popularity in the industry. And it's why Prosico's Consolidec line is based around lithium silicate technology. The decision of how to densify your floor may seem small, but it is the foundation of how durable and long-lasting the floor will be. So, head over to Prosico.com to find out how densification can make your floor look great and last longer, and how Prosico's Consolidec products can help you get there.